Hey everyone, today we are going to solve the little question Pascal's triangle 2. Okay, so key point to solve this question is how can we calculate left and right number in above row and create a current row? So let me explain the key point today. Before I explain the key point, actually there is a formula for Pascal triangle. And uh, based on the formula, you can implement solution code like this. But uh, in real interview, it's hard to come up with a formula, right? So I don't use this solution. Okay, so let me explain the key point. So for example, look at uh, this number, 4. So the reason why this position is 4 is that so we calculate the left number, right number in the above row. So in this case, 1 plus 3. So that's why uh, this position is 4. And I look at uh, this number, uh, 3 plus 3 is 6, right? And I look at uh, this number, 3 plus 1 is 4, right? So the problem is, so look at this number. So we have left number 1, but there is no right number, right? So how can we calculate uh, for this position? Actually, same situation happen in the each row. So for example, look at the second row. So second row is 1, 1, but uh, there is no left number for this position and uh, there is no right number for this uh, position. So how can we calculate uh, uh, these two, one? So, so actually this is a, a Pascal triangle one. So I uh, have a video, so I put the link in the description below so you can check later. So in the video, uh, my strategy is add zero to first place and the last place in the above row so that we can calculate like a 0 plus 1 is 1 and a 1 plus 0 is 1. So if we put the 0 to the first place and the last place, so we don't have to check like out of bounds with like if statement. Also, uh, 0 doesn't affect uh, result of calculation, right? So we can simply uh, calculate uh, like a left number and a right number. So for the third row, uh, we can do the same thing, like uh, add a zero to the first place and the last place, so that we can calculate like a zero plus one plus one, and a one plus one plus two, and a one plus zero plus uh, equal one, right? So yeah, uh, this solution works. So this is a basic idea to solve this question. Okay, so let me demonstrate one by one. So let's create uh, this row, one, three, three, one. Actually, there are several ways to solve this question, but my strategy is like this. So we know that we add left and right numbers in above row and then create a current row. So we iterate through the same two above rows at the same time, but add zero to the first position for one row and add zero to the last position for the other row. So what I'm trying to say is that, so let's create a second row because the first row is obvious, right? Just only one. But uh, when we create a second row, we use a uh, first row twice. But uh, as I told you, uh, add zero to the first place for one list. So that's why zero, one. And uh, add zero to the last position for the other row, uh, the other list. So that's why one, zero. So I'm creating like, a, so for this list, zero, one is this, the, uh, these two uh, number, first two number, and uh, one zero is the last two number, like this. And then we iterate, iterate through uh, these two lists one by one, and uh, just add each position. So first, uh, so in index zero is a uh, zero plus one, right? That means, so this is a, like a purple uh, area, like a zero plus one. So zero comes from um, first, this actually this is a, a left number and uh, one comes from so one zero this this is a right uh, list so so that we can uh, calculate for this position right so zero plus one is one and then calculate for this position so um, one comes from a left number so that means this one right plus um, zero comes from right number zero right so this is uh, for this zero so one plus zero is one right so look at the second row uh, one one so we create one one so looks good right so actually uh, we do the same thing so 
Next, we add zero to this uh, result list so that we can create a zero one one one, right? So same thing. Um, zero one one comes from the first three row in like a zero one one zero, and a one one zero comes from the last three uh, number, uh, like a one one zero. So all we have to do is just uh, calculate uh, uh, these two uh, list. So uh, in this case, one plus not plus one to one, right? And uh, look at uh, this row. So one to one, one to one, right? Looks good. And then um, at last, uh, again, uh, we add zero um, to the first place and the last place so that we can create a zero, one, two, one, zero, right? And I look at uh, these two lists. So left number should be the first four number. So zero, one, two, one. So zero, one, two, one, right? And the uh, right number should be the last four number. So one, two, one, zero. One, two, one, zero, looks good. And all we have to do is just calculate each number, each position. So one, three, Oops, and um, three, one, right? And uh, look at the target row. So one, three, three, one, right? One, three, three, one, looks good. Yeah, so that is a basic idea to solve this question. So with that being said, let's get into the code. Okay, so let's write the code. First of all, initialize row and one. So this is a, a first row, it's obvious, right? And then iterate through one by one, so in range, and uh, row index. So uh, we can do like this. So row equal uh, left plus right for uh, left and right in. So we can use zip so that we can uh, iterate through the two list at the same time. And then, um, as I told you, uh, create a two row. So add zero to the first row for one row. So zero plus row. And uh, on the other hand, add zero to the last for the other row. So row plus zero. Yeah, actually that's it. After that, return row. Yeah, so let me submit it. Yeah, looks good. And very efficient algorithm beat 99%. So time complexity of this solution should be, uh, I think, on square. So where n is a number of row. So we iterate through a number of row n, and in each row we have n numbers, right? So that's why n by n, o n square. And the space complexity should be order of n uh, because of uh, this row, right? Yeah, so that's all I have for you today. If you like it, please subscribe to the channel, hit the like button, or leave a comment. I'll see you in the next question.